differentiate e raised to power x into log x we will differentiate it by using taking log on both sides so it becomes log y is equal to log e raised to power x into log x now log y is equal to now we will use formula log m raised to power n is equal to n log m so power will come forward x log x into log e we know that log of e is equal to 1 therefore becomes log y is equal to x log x now we will do differentiation differentiate both sides with respect to x so it becomes 1 over y into dy by dx is equal to here we will use u into v form x into d dx of log x plus log x will remain as it is into d dx of x right now 1 over y dy by dx will remain as it is it becomes x now derivative of log x with respect to x is 1 over x plus log x derivative of x with respect to x is 1 so it becomes 1 over y dy by dx is equal to x and x is cancelled 1 plus log x now it becomes dy by dx is equal to now y will come on the right side y into 1 plus log x we will put the value of y from equation number 1 which is already given so it implies it becomes dy over dx is equal to e raised to power x log x into 1 plus log x we will write here using 1 <clears throat> now it becomes dy by dx is equal to now we can use here again formula log m raised to power n is equal to n log m now it becomes e raised to power log x raised to power x 1 plus log x now log and exponent will cancel each other so our answer will be dy by dx is equal to x raised to power x 1 plus log x right this is our answer now next question is differentiate y is equal to log x raised to power log x now we will take log on both sides it becomes log y is equal to log of log x raised to power log x right now again we will use the formula log m raised to power n is equal to n log m so it becomes log y is equal to log x into log of log x right now we will do differentiation so differentiate both sides with respect to x okay now differentiation of log y 1 over y dy by dx is equal to now here we will use u into v form log x will remain as it is now we will do d dx of log of log x plus log of log x will remain as it is we will do d dx of log x right now this becomes 1 over y dy by dx is equal to now log x will remain as it is now we will do derivative of log of log x derivative of log is 1 over x so it becomes 1 over log x and again d dx of log x plus log of log x will remain as it is and we have to do derivative of log x which is 1 over x now this implies 1 over y dy by dx is equal to now log and log are cancelled so derivative of log x is 1 over x plus log of log x will remain as it is into 1 over x right now 
this becomes dy by dx is equal to y into 1 over x plus log of log x plus into 1 over x right now we we can take lcm also now this implies dy by dx is equal to also we will put the value of y from equation number 1 so it will be log x raised to power log x now bracket start now we can take lcm 1 plus log of log x over whole over x now this is our answer Now next question is y is equal to log x raised to power cos x. We will take log on both sides. So it becomes log y is equal to log of log x raised to power cos x. Right. Now using log m raised to power n is equal to n log m. It becomes log y is equal to now cos x will come forward cos x into log of log x here we will again use u into v form when we differentiate to differentiate both sides with respect to x right it becomes 1 over y dy by dx is equal to now u will remain as it is we will do ddx of log of log x plus cos x uh, log of log x will remain as it is and we will do ddx of cos x right now 1 over y dy by dx as it is now cos x into now derivative of log of log x is 1 over log x and we will do again derivative of log x right plus log of log x will remain as it is now derivative of cos x is minus sin x now this becomes 1 over y dy by dx is equal to cos x over log x into now derivative of log x is 1 over x now minus will come forward sin x into log of log x next step dy by dx is equal to y will come another side now y into cos x over log x or we will write x log x minus sin of sin x into log of log x now we will put the value of y from equation number 1 it becomes log x raised to power cos x log x raised to power cos x then bracket start cos x over x log x minus sin x into log x log of log x sorry this is our answer. We will write here using 1. This is our answer. Now next question is y is equal to sin x raised to power cos x. Again we will take log on both sides. So it becomes log y is equal to log of sin x raised to power cos x. Again, we will use formula log m raised to power n is equal to n log m. So, power will come forward. Log y is equal to no, cos x into log of sin x. When we will differentiate, it becomes u and this becomes v. Right? So, differentiate both sides with respect to x. Now, derivative is 1 over y dy by dx is equal to cos x will remain as it is. 
Now we will do derivative of log of sin x plus log of sin x will remain as it is and we will do derivative of cos x. Now 1 over y dy by dx will remain as it is which is equal to cos x into. Now derivative of log is 1 over x so it becomes 1 over sin x. Then again we will do ddx of sin x plus log of sin x will remain as it is ddx of cos x is minus sin x. Now it becomes cos over sin. Cos over sin means it becomes cos cos over sin is cot x. Now derivative of sin x is cos x plus log of sin x into minus sin x. We can write here uh, cos x over sin x is equal to cot x. Right. Now we will take y to right side. It comes in the numerator. So y into cos x into cot x minus sin x into log of sin x. Now we will put value of y from equation number 1. Now this is 1. So it's sin x raised to power cos x. Sin x raised to power cos x into like it start cos x into cot x minus sin x into log of sin x. This is our answer. Now next question is y is equal to tan x raised to power 1 over x. Now we will take log on both sides. It becomes log y is equal to log of tan x raised to power 1 over x. Now again we will use the formula log m raised to power n is equal to n log m. So it becomes 1 over x log of tan x. Now for differentiating we will use u into v form here. Right. Differentiate both sides with respect to x. So when we will differentiate log y becomes 1 over y dy by dx is equal to now u into v form u will remain as it is we will do derivative of v it means log of tan x plus log of tan x will remain as it is and we will do ddx of 1 over x. Now this is equal to 1 over x will remain as it is derivative of log of tan x. Derivative of log is 1 over x. It means 1 over tan x. And again we will do derivative of tan x. Plus log of tan x will remain as it is. Derivative of 1 over x. Means we can also write it as x inverse. So we will use here power formula. It is It becomes minus 1 x raised to power minus 2. It means minus 1 over x square. So it's minus 1 over x square right now 1 over x into 1 over tan x now derivative of tan x is secant square x plus or we can say minus log of tan x over x square now we will take y to this side so it becomes dy by dx is equal to y then bracket secant square x over x tan x minus log tan x over x square. Now our step will be we will put the value of y from equation 1. So tan x raised to power 1 by x tan x raised to power 1 by x to secant square x 
over x tan x minus log of tan x over x square. This is our answer and this question is completed. I think this is clear to everyone. Thank you.